Good morning. I hope you're doing well. Uh, I'm so glad you're here. I'm so glad you've joined us. You and your family have joined us for worship here at First Presbyterian. A little bit different than we're used to doing, but it's worship nonetheless, and I'm so glad you're here to be part of it. I want to start by reading you one little bitty verse out of the Bible. This is from the book of Psalms, and you, you know, we've been talking about Psalms so much. Anyway, it starts and it says, you yourself, and he's talking to God, and he says, you, God, have kept track of my sadness. You have put my tears into your bottle. And I thought, isn't that an interesting thing that you have a bottle for tears? Um, you know what? Look at here. I have my own bottle for tears. Now, I need to tell you, that's not real tears in there. That's just water. Um, it's a, it's a, a what, baby oil bottle. Um, and I just put water in there. But it reminds me of the times when I cry or when other people in my life or in the world are crying. Do you ever cry? I bet you do. I think I've seen one or two of you at church crying. Um, everybody needs to cry every once in a while. I made a list of some things that make me cry. Um, when I get hurt or when, I, when I'm hurting, that can make me cry. One time, a long time ago, I had a spider bite, and it wouldn't go away. And I had to have it doctored on for a long time, and I cried a lot about that spider bite. Um, one time, or several times I've cried um, because I'm sad. Uh, doesn't matter what you're sad about it, you just cry. Um, sometimes I cry when my feelings get hurt. People might not mean to hurt my feelings, but they do it. So I bet you've had your feelings hurt before too. And you know what? One thing that always makes me cry is when I see other people sad and crying, and I cry with them. Um, did you know that Jesus cried? There's several verses in the Bible about times that Jesus cried. In fact, the very shortest verse in the Bible is this. Jesus wept. Jesus cried. Um, the Bible tells us that Jesus cried when he prayed for others. Um, while Jesus was here on earth, it says he offered prayers and pleadings with a loud cry and tears. Um, another time, uh, the Bible tells us that Jesus cried when he went to uh, his friend's home. Uh, Mary and Martha and Lazarus were friends of his, and Lazarus had died. And Jesus was so sad. And that's when that shortest verse in the Bible came in. Jesus wept. Um, Jesus wept with Mary and Martha. And then he raised Lazarus from the dead. We all cry. I'm just so happy that we have a God who understands our cries. And who cries with us. I am glad that God loves us so much that God keeps a bottle of our tears. I am glad that God loves us and understands our sadness and our hurts. Uh, that's a very comforting thing. So remember that God cries, Jesus cries, and we cry. And all of that is okay. Let's have a short prayer. Loving God, we thank you that you are a God who knows our hurts and who cries with us. Be with us as we go throughout our, this week, laughing and crying and all the things in between. Thank you, God. Amen. All right. I'll see you soon, I hope. Take care. Be sweet. Wash your hands. Bye.